Hi everyone, this is Laura and today I have a layout to share with you. And this layout I created this weekend while I was crafting with some beautiful scrappy sisters and I just want to thank them again for um, joining me this weekend. You all know who you are. I had so, so much fun. And I just can't. Oh, I am so loving my toy. Oh, yes. I just thought about this um, right before um, right before I decided to load up this video before I go have some lunch. Um, yeah, because I have like six more videos, guys, and I just don't want to bombard everyone all at once. So I'm trying to um, shove everything together. Um, my first announcement that I want to make before I get into my layout is that I did, I am very well aware that I passed my 300 subbies. However, with the holidays and everything, and I am just like super busy, super crazy, I'm not going to have a giveaway um, challenge, which I decided I am going to do. I'm going to have a giveaway challenge, but it won't be until next month. So if I'm still at 300 and change or 400, that'll be when I'm going to do my giveaway challenge. So look forward to that for the month of January. But <clears throat> I have a different challenge for you guys. And my challenge for you guys is this. This is going to be for just a little thank you um, present. I am going to gift someone with a little thank you gift. Um, but in order to get the gift, I need your help. I need help in naming my new baby, my little helper here. And this is um, a gift that was bestowed to me by my beautiful scrappy sister here on YouTube. Her name is Vicky, who's me love Bono. And I have wanted one of these like forever and a day. And she sent me one. And it is the most beautifulest of little um, helpers. I don't want to say once because hers is called the one and I don't want to copy her. So what I want you guys to do is this. I want a name for my helper. I want you guys to think of a name and send me, um, leave it in the comments of this video below what you think the name of my little helper should be. Um, I do not know if it's a male or a female yet and that will be based on the name. I want you to give me a male name and a female name. I want it to begin with a V, and I want it to be a very, very unique name. I like really odd, odd, odd things. I don't like the common thing. Um, I like very unique um, names, so the odder the better. Um, and whoever's name I choose, and I will choose it by next week, Whosever name I choose for my little friend here will get a little gift from me. And I will announce what that gift is going to be plus the name of um, the winner next week when I decide whether she's a male or he's a female. I mean, he's a male or she's a female. <laughs> so that's my little announcement for my want. It's just a mini Thank you, um, and just a little something until next month, until I have my real um, big giveaway. This is just a teeny tiny little holiday spirited, um, find me a name for my friend giveaway. Um, yeah, it's just going to be a little something to say thank you to the person who helps me find a name for my baby. Okie dokie. So, in again, Vicky, thank you so much, girl. I am so happy and tickled with my little friend here. But he and she doesn't have a name yet. And you know what, Auntie Vicky, you come up with a name too. Um, well, gosh, I was going to already send you something, but I'll just send you two somethings. <laughs> to thank you for my little friend here. So, um, yeah. 
again, I want it to be, I want a girl and a boy name, and it has to begin with the letter V in honor of my beautiful friend who gifted it to me. So real quick for my layout now, um, like I said, please excuse the mess on my desk. I've been working on so much stuff. I've been kind of on a lazy mode and cleaning up. I've been creating, but not cleaning. Um, up on the top here, I have some little red metallic brads. I don't know if you guys can see that. I put one in each corner, and that's them right there. Over here, I have some um, blue satin trim that I've had in my stash forever, and it has like little snowflakes. And I thought that would go well with this paper collection. Again, like I said, I do not. Um, know the name of this paper collection uh, because I think it's by Pink Paisley but um, I don't remember the name too well I know it was part of um, the Naughty and Nice collection and as was this one I believe as well and these two um, photo mats I actually cut out using my Lifestyle cutting dice, and this is the nesting frames number five. And that's what I cut out both photo mats on. I added a little bow here and here using this um, very pretty glittery sparkly red ribbon. Over here, this is a Tim Holtz die that I have in my stash, and I added some of this black metal chains and these posts and I also added some red eyelets here and also on the signage on the sign itself this is a piece of cardstock and this um, I got from that um, cardstock stack that I showed you earlier um, when I showed you my cards this came from the K and Company um, Christmas die cut stack again some of that blue snowflake ribbon in the back and the photo mats guys I um, also cut out another layer in the back um, using a blue cardstock that I had in my stash and over here I have a little metal reindeer um, um, charm that I hot glued on the corner. I added some red stickles here and here. I did color this in first using um, this right here. This is um, Magical Micas and they are from Lindy Stamp Gang. And this is called Ponciana Red Flame. And it is a beautiful shimmery red. Love it, love it, love it. Over here, I have a little metal um, charm that I've had in my stash forever from Paper Pizzazz. Um, I don't, I don't remember who made them though. I'm so sorry, guys. And it's just a little holly leaf, and I added a little bow on top instead of little um, berries. I added a little red bow. And these are just some die cut images that I cut out um, from my stamps. And I believe the stamp sets I used for that were the bow bunny. Um, yes. It was this. <clears throat> and this is an old stamp set. This is a Bow Bunny Christmas stamp. And this is one of the Lost and Found Christmas um, stamp sets as well. And I added some silver bling on the little tree. I also added a little um, stocking. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's a little Christmas stocking with toys in it. It's a little silver charm. I added some of these embellies from that um, this is from the good tidings embellies and these are just rubber embellies from KI memories and of course I added some stickles 
There's a pretty little bird. And this is a die from the Tim Holtz dies. It's the mini one. It's a little camera. And I colored that with my Perfect Pearls, the Forever Green. I added a little red bling there and there. And again, this is just a little bird from the stamp set. And this is also from the stamp set. So that's my layout, guys. Um, challenging colors for me to work with. But I did it. I hope you all like it. And please leave a comment below. And don't forget, leave me um, your choice of names, one male, one female. And if you are the lucky person to give my baby here his or her proper name, I will gift you with a thank you gift. Yep. I just love it. This is going to make my layout sharing so much fun and a lot easier. Yay! So, thank you all for watching. Have a blessed Monday. And don't forget, leave me your ideas about a name for my buddy here. Talk to you soon. Bye now.